So today I'm going to demonstrate what makes carbon streaks and bubbles in the glass. If I start with a cold mold and spray a mold lubricant on it, then the first pour dissolves the carbon and graphite in the mold lubricant and the folds of the glass trap it inside. So I'm going to use this graphite spray which is not that much unlike the Pioneer method except that it's in an aerosol can instead of in a, a lacquer or a shellac base. So you can see that the, the propellant in the spray is vaporizing. And that's trapping uh, graphite inside the glass. So here's a look at this one here with all the graphite chunks and uh, bubbles in it. You can see how the graphite got caught in the folds of the glass because it was still in its liquid form when the glass was poured into the mold. The dome has a nice cloud in it, which is very, very small bubbles caused by the trapped gases. <laughs> 